motherfuckers, Mr. Man up in this bitch. Coming at you pre-recorded uh, once again. Part two of this uh, I Got Love series. Uh, Two-part series. I don't know. Uh, I just had a couple homeboys sending me some shit. My homeboy Mike Simons went ahead and sent me a whole bunch of cool shit uh, from a brand new company. I, well, I don't know if they're brand new, but I never heard of them. Brand new to me and a little brownie. But uh, I got love, baby. The homeboy Steve Latson um, hooked it up with uh, with a box of his own. I know it's in here, or at least I'm pretty sure. At least what some of it is in here. So let's just crack this bitch open and uh, see what the hell's going on. If I can cut this shit. You know, I'm, I'm always terrible at this shit. <laughs> I'm good at shooting, I swear, but... Cut it. I mean, I'm, I'm better when it's not trying to be efficient and neat, but... Oh, what is all this? Oh, yeah. I know what that is. Oh, yeah. What? Okay. I remember this. What? I've never had this one before. Oh, shit. Okay. Wow. All right. Steve Lassen. I see you. Uh, let's see what's in here. All right. Cool. So... Let me see here. It says, don't be afraid. Just super hot jerky. Video or it didn't happen. So sorry about my last card, Steve. So, a little backstory. Uh, one of my better, one of my best customers, actually, to be honest. Uh, post office jacked his uh, payment. That sucks. Ugh, fucking post office. The one time I needed the, the cheddar, too. So... Alright, I don't know. Right, I'm gonna try this last. I think I played the same song. I was trying to play the remix one now that I played the original one. Where the hell is it? Here we go. Alright, so that one's a lot louder. So, anybody knows me knows I love me some Nate Dog. And since I got love, I, I want to show love back to the homeboy. <laughs> so, I want to go in order of um, heat level. So this is habanero, so I definitely want to try that. Wonder if this is gonna give me a run for my money, huh? This is supposed to be the hottest. Damn, it's a lot of uh, beef jerky, bro. So he made it with I think volcanic peppers uh, powder. It says super hot. I want to try it on camera. Uh, so this is habanero and smoked ghost pepper. So this is probably the middle man, man. So uh, all right, fabulous. Why don't you shut the fuck up right now so I can listen to my thoughts. For the gangster lean, you're looking at a coast to coast G. I got love, but I still stash the coast poster closely. I don't even know what I'm saying. I can't rap anymore. I used to be a, 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 a fucking YouTube rapper. I'm done. I'm done with that. <laughs> Put my guns away. I just wanted to uh, showcase my guns since uh, my man uh, Steve is a uh, Glock aficionado. I would say not really, but I got uh, my my 21 SF and uh, my 17. Gen 3 with uh, laser beams on them because I can't I can't be bothered to aim down iron sights and shit. No, I'm just joking. I don't I, I don't know why I put lasers on them. It's not like it makes it accurate or nothing. And I'm and I'm good without them anyways, so allegedly. Anyways. Uh, <laughs> so let me go ahead and run through these uh, things real quick and close it before I kill myself. Um, so Secret Aardvark, I've seen this before, definitely. Uh, I've never tried it. It's habanero hot sauce. I'm not sure if uh, the homeboy Mike has tried it before. Maybe Paul Reef. Um, and like I said, this has volcano peppers powder, I want to say. I'm not 100% sure. I should have paid attention, but I got like ADD or something. So I never know what's going on ever. So Secret Aardvark, habanero hot sauce. Sauce. Ah, Christ. I think I'm going to run out of uh, storage space on my phone here. So it says uh, tomatoes, tomato and fire roasted tomatoes, tomato juice, calcium chloride, white wine vinegar, carrots, uh, water, yellow, onion, habanero pepper, habanero peppers, water, salt, mustard, distilled uh, vinegar, water, mustard seeds, salt, turmeric, spices, organic cane sugar, salt, modified food starch, garlic, sunflower oil, herbs, and spices. It says refrigerate after opening. It's a lot of ingredients. Eight ounces though. That's, that's a lot of uh, ounces. The shake well, pretty sure I did, but it says uh, the flavor that kicks you in the mouth. Uh, not your usual hot sauce. A unique Caribbean Tex-Mex hybrid made with flavorful habanero peppers and roasted tomatoes. Great as a sauce. 
marinade or holistic cure-all. Dump on everything. The secret aardvark compels you. And they got a uh, aardvark red eye, which is a red beer. Two ounce tomato juice, 14 ounce beer. One tablespoon of secret aardvark habanero sauce. Pour the tomato juice in a beer mug. Fill with beer. Add one tablespoon or more of aardvark. We recommend more salt to taste. More recipes and secret info at secretartvark.com. No GMOs made in the USA. Shake well. Don't be a jerk. Please recycle. I'm not, I'm not, not going to recycle. Fuck recycling. The earth uh, created plastic. The earth's going to absorb. It's the same fucking plastics. It's not. doesn't matter. I don't care if it's in the ocean. The lava will take over. I know. I don't care. I don't, I don't give a shit. I don't care. What, what am I invested in in this planet here? Ooh, it smells good. Mmm. Wow. That's very delicious sauce already. Again, no spoon. Very ill prepared. It's kind of, um, kind of smells reminiscent of uh, Taco Bell, but I'm sure it's way more gourmet than the Taco Bell sauces. But it's kind of like a cross between the Fire and the Diablo, to be honest. Nice, nice consistency. Love, I love that consistency. That's like my perfect texture. Consistency. Mmm. Wow, yeah. Yeah, that is good, man. Um, it's a lot different than my habanero, of course, but... I could, does it have cumin? No. Mm. That is very delicious. Very traditional. Taco sauce, you know. Reminds me of the, the Palo Alto kind of ones. Um, the habanero ones. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. That is very delicious. My God. Definitely a three out of three. You can tell this is more. I believe I got cut off. <laughs> so, as I was saying uh, before, I was so rudely interrupted. Uh, you can tell this is kind of like a commercial sauce, though. It's got a uh, kind of a lot of ingredients, a lot of uh, extra shit in it. It's kind of commercial uh, flavor, I guess. But it's, it's it's very delicious. Yeah, very delicious. We'll go great on tacos. Or Taco Bell. Uh, I love Taco Bell, by the way. You should already know that. Uh, so I'm going to try this one. So the funny part about this one was uh, he uh, he bought this and he wasn't really a fan. Because he said, uh, I don't know, maybe it's too smoky or something like that. I, I'm typically not a fan of smoked uh, sauces or anything like that. But I, I like anything Pex Peppers usually. Then again, sometimes um, certain things, I don't know. I don't know what the fuck I'm saying. <laughs> but, um, so this one is To the Moon, Habanero, and Smoked Ghost Pepper. Um, here's a nutrition fact. I don't know if I show you the nutrition facts on this one, but here they are just in case. Not like you can see them or read them anyways. <clears throat> so it says, uh, get ready to blast off. Get ready for blast off. With Pex Peppers to the Moon, hot sauce, you'll be launched out of this world. We combine the sizzling Caribbean red habanero with smoked ghost pepper, garlic, lime juice, and red onion to create a hot sauce. Uh, that could be used for anything. To the moon has the perfect amount of smoky flavor to accent almost any food. Use sparingly or you will shoot to the moon. Please refrigerate after opening. Distributed by Pex Peppers, LLC. 1808 Logan Avenue, <coughs> Pueblo, Colorado, 81004. Info at PexPeppers.com. It's a 7 out of 10. It says it's pretty spicy, which for Pex Peppers, it's probably fucking hot. Um, probably made in Colorado. Uh, ingredients is red, haban red habanero mash, red habaneros and vinegar, vinegar, garlic, red onion, lime juice, smoked ghost pepper, and salt. All right, so uh, he was actually uh, going to get rid of these because I guess he didn't like them that much. Uh, so I was like, you know, hey, I'll, I'll take it off your hands or whatever. I never tried it before, and I like a lot of things Pex Pepper, so maybe I'll like it. He uh, reluctantly sent them. Um, I was actually supposed to get this with my, uh, my payment that the post office jacked, but I forget what he said happened, but, you know. It is what it is, man. The universe hates me. What can I say? But, again, it, it reciprocates the love back uh, and shit like this. So, I'm not uh, sweating it. It's 85 bucks, but whatever. What can I do, man? Uh, I hope whoever took the money out the envelope really needed the shit more than me, even. Which, I don't know if that's possible at this moment in time, but we'll see. I can, I can only smell out of this nostril i was gonna say this nose but i got only one nose so i'm gonna try this it doesn't smell that smoky uh let me see 
it's uh it's you know not not too thick but not too thin either it's a nice uh medium consistency a little a little bit on the on the runnier side and what i like you know it's kind of dripping down here but my one nose is water one nose one nostril is watering the other one's clean as a whistle Well, I don't hate it. <clears throat> yeah, I don't hate it. It's not bad. For some reason, it tastes tomato-y, which I don't think it has tomatoes. Maybe it's the habaneros. You know, one thing with Peck's peppers is you always taste the shit out of the peppers. Um, that tastes like I'm biting a fucking... Smoked ghost pepper right now. Yeah, I don't hate it. <clears throat> I, I don't particularly love it either, but uh, it's it's not bad. It's it's pretty good. Uh, it, it, I think you would just have to right find the right use for it. Um, I'm thinking this would have to be something like maybe a pork chop, uh, pork tenderloin once again, uh, maybe a a burger, something like that. I think that would go well on a burger. With like some some white cheese or something like that and bacon and shit. So not too bad though. So now here's what I'm really uh, looking forward to. He made some beef jerky with some uh, volcano something powder. I, I, you know I should have looked in the in the time that I was over here resetting all my shit and <laughs> deleting old concert videos that I got archived already. Okay, let's see what this is uh, looking like. He made a ton. Wish I had my scale. Okay, it smells. Uh, it doesn't smell that spicy. Let me cleanse the palate once again, just to make sure. I'm getting this like filmy, mucusy, ah, like thing on the back of my tongue. Pause. Ah, okay, well, let's try this out. Give me a good piece here somewhere. Uh, well, I guess that's uh, as good as it gets, right? So you can see the uh, chili flakes in it. And, uh, well, just pop it in and see what the fuck's going on here. Mmm. Thick. Mmm. This is the first thing I'm eating today. I haven't had any food since, uh, I don't know, 6 o'clock last night. It's like um, 124 p.m. right now. Mmm, very delicious. I like that this is like kind of thick jerky. Still got juiciness to it. <clears throat> it's not like the ones where you gotta fucking rip your teeth out. Mmm. It seems very dank. It's got like a, a, a thick moisture to it. Mmm. Mmm. That's good shit. This is good jerky, man. See. <clears throat> You, uh, you outdo yourself here with this jerky, man. Super moist, super thick. Look at the thickness of that. Thick cuts. Mm. It's got a little, it's got a little warmth to it, though. Uh, I was hoping to start sweating or dying or something, but, mm. Mm. But it's fucking delicious, bro. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. I wonder, it's very hearty. This feels like I'm eating like, I don't know, almost like, I'm not going to say arracheras, but, mmm, but it's very steaky, meaty, meaty, thick, juicy, flavorful, well seasoned, got a nice kick to it, mmm, 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 I'm going to fuck around and eat this whole bag right here, mmm. My God. Okay. I gotta stop because I mean, one more piece. That's it. One more piece. Mm. You see the chili flakes. Man, this is really good. All right. <laughs> this is a very delicious jerky, man. Um, thank you so much for this. First of all, there's a lot of meat. And um, I know, you know, I've made jerky myself and it takes... A long fall. Okay, 
Now I'm starting to pick up on the warmth, you know. Mm mm mm. Fucking delicious though. I'm not sure what cut you use, eye of round or something, but I've, I've done jerky in the past and it's. Mm, that is very good, man. I don't know what the hell you. You gotta give me this recipe or something like that. I don't know. Uh, I've done jerky in the past with like a thin eye of round and it, it didn't come out bad, but it just. It's not like this. You and Paul Reef make some fucking amazing jerky. And uh, other than Katie's beef jerky, Katie's got you guys on lock. Sorry, man. She's she's a professional at what she does, but you guys are up there. Mm, one more piece. One more piece. <laughs> For real, man. I'm I'm digging the shit out of the jerky. It's so soft. There's like it's not even jerky. It's like tender cuts or something. I don't know. Mm, look at that. Ah. Oh. Fucking amazing. Mm. I want to learn how to make this because I, I always need little, little snacks and shit when I'm just fucking around, you know? Mmm. 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 What? I don't know what this is. Am I, why am I eating it? But, um, man. Super fucking delicious, bro. I can eat this shit all day. So, definitely uh, three out of three on the jerky. Uh, this one wasn't bad, like I said. I, I gave it a two. It, it, uh, I'll give it a 2.3 because it slightly exceeded my expectations. But I was expecting the worst because uh, just because he said he was going to toss it. So, uh, this was definitely beyond my expectations. Uh, I'll give it a three stars for sure. Very delicious hot sauce. Very fucking delicious beef jerky, man. Uh, I want more. I don't want to kill it all, though. I want to, like, still have some for, like, later and shit. Uh, but, man, look at that. Shit is great. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Magnifique. Uh, Steve Lightson, you know what you're doing. Mmm. Thank you once again. Mmm. Can't say enough good shit about this. But anyway. Immaculate. <laughs> and that's good because I didn't eat shit. So this is like a nice little warm up for my meal later tonight. And then, I don't know, four hours, five hours, some shit like that. But we'll see. Mm, I just bit the shit out of the inside of my mouth. Mm. Fucking beef jerky, man. You need to go into business and start selling this shit, man. This is some fucking amazing beef jerky, to be honest. 100% honest right now. Um, I'm always 100% honest anyway, but. That's it, man. That, that's all I'm going to say. Thank you for watching. And peace out. Peace out!